And I think like to, to come back into the search query performance report for a second and, and look at, you know, a lot of what we've talked about is that brand search term report. And within that brand search term report, one thing I want to kind of hone in on for, for just a second is like looking at individual products. Oftentimes within any brand, there will be search terms that are fairly product specific within that report. And I would say that's like a really good time to pivot over to the ASIN analyzer within search query performance, where you can start to, you know, you actually plug in an ASIN and it will give you the top 100 search terms for that particular ASIN. So um, that's another way when you're looking at uh, a search term that maybe is more specific to a subset of your products, like a product line or a product style, you can start to look at those products in the ASIN analyzer and see if that term comes up underneath any of those products as you're kind of doing a reverse search by looking at those products to see if that term comes up. And then you can say, okay, well, I should probably take these products in this kind of like subset of my catalog and fine tune the SEO or fine tune things about this, because those are probably going to be where I can be able to gain the most traction on that search term in the like brand report uh, by yeah. using or leveraging this subset of products to, to, you know, take the most frictionless route to, to get to that success to the holy grail of, you know, tons yeah. and tons of impressions. So and another thing that Amazon has done, if you switch to the ASIN view, then it kind of becomes tedious because you have to then select the SKU, then the select yep. the week and the week now. So it becomes a few more selections. But when you do that and then you get the numbers up, it gives you exactly the same view, the, the keywords on the side, and then you have the impressions and blah, blah. But this time... When you click on the keyword, it puts you on another page. And on that page, it shows you the top three ASINs that you are yeah. competing. So, I mean, that's that's huge. And you can go skew by skew and see who is doing and their price points and what kind of click-through rate they are getting and what kind of... I mean, you're getting everything about your competition, right? 